We have just left the mouth of the Amazon and we are steaming 30 something hours out to explore a newly discovered reef for the first time. We're going to use a two person deep worker submarine. It can go down to 600 meters. We'll be working with a team of Brazilian scientists to do this exploration. And it's very exciting because we really don't know anything about this reef. Well, we're right on the point. The, the area we want to go into is, is 250 meters in front of us. The visibility is great. The uh, conditions are good. Visibility out here in the water. There's even a rainbow out there. Look at that. Primeiro mergulho vai ser numa estação bem funda, a quebra da plataforma que a gente não tem informação nenhuma ainda. E pelos vídeos da drop cam a gente conseguiu ver que tem bastante coisa interessante. Deep worker, deep worker, top side. There's a butterfly fish, a small one, Catodon sedentarius. And there is also this tiny octocoral. Yeah, it's definitely a cleaning station, maybe the deepest one ever recorded. Wow. Agora sim estamos chegando num recife bastante alto, íngreme. Já estamos aqui a aproximadamente 180 metros e o Recife é é contínuo. Um, this has been a fairly sandy area. It's been very mixed. I think one of the defining characteristics of the Amazon Reef so far is that it's not just one type of habitat, but many we've seen. We have oil companies that want to start drilling in the area, which obviously would put all of this at risk before we really even understand what we have. Um, now you can see the green lasers that we use. These are called indexing lasers. They're very low power. They don't have any threat to the fish or to people. Um, they're only there to help the science team measure what's in the video. Deep worker, deep worker, top side, no copy, VHF. It's really exciting to finally see the Amazon Reef for the first time. Mm -hmm.